Hello everyone, my name is Ravinder Nagulavancha. Today we will learn about how to add pass through ports to any XML based transformations or web services consumer transformation. As you know, uh, any XML transformation uh, like an XML parser or XML generator uh, is an active transformation and you cannot uh, add pass through ports uh, uh, by dragging and dropping onto them like you do for uh, uh, any expression transformations. So, uh, uh, same goes for the web services consumer as well. So, uh, you need to add pass through ports in a different way, uh, not like the passive ones. So, uh, I'm going to show you that uh, in the designer how to do that. Okay, so let me quickly switch back to the designer. Here I have a mapping with an XML parser. It's a pretty simple mapping. Uh, all it has is one parser. So as you can see, I want to add this pass-through port to the parser and get it through one of the output views. So to do that, right click on the parser, edit it. Click on new port, add a pass-through port with any name uh, and, and select the appropriate data type. connect it so now i need to get it through the output views so that's the tricky part so click on edit and go to the midstream xml parser go to the xml editor view and uh, here you can click on any view and do an add a reference port click on the pass through and click ok click on OK and uh, that's it so you can see the reference port here so whatever the value that you pass through the expression transformation to the our um, parser input will come through here so I will show the same thing in the uh, web services consumer as well so I have a mapping for that. If you look at the consumer, here is the request side and here is the response side. I want to send the pass through to the request side and get it on the response side. So uh, right click on the edit and consumer transformation. Click on add pass through port. Again, give any name. Select the appropriate data type and click OK. This is what you will select, uh, connect on the input side. Now on the output side, right click on the consumer transformation, go to visual workspace, output mode, right click on the view, add a reference port and select the pass report that you have added. Apply changes and you will see the reference port connected to the next uh, next transformation or in this case target whatever the widget that that is the next that you want so uh, uh, that's about it this is how you know you add it in the this the, the same thing works for the xml generator also i haven't shown that but any xml based ones you can use the same procedure so yeah uh, thanks for uh, watching the video uh, and uh, for any feedback uh, you can uh, um, email at supportvideos at informatica.com or twitter.com info support. Okay. Thank you.